Good evening everyone, this is MEC32, Mechanics of Reformal Bodies. I am Mark Daniel Community to discuss about torsion. So torsion is a shearing stress developed when shaft is loaded by twisting couples in place that are perpendicular to the axis of the shaft. Here's the formulas needed for this topic. So shearing stress is equals to torque applied times radial distance over polar moment inertia, while angle of twist is equal to applied torque times length over polar moment of inertia times modulus of rigidity. So, this is the first question. What is the minimum diameter of a solid steel shaft that will not twist through more than 3 degrees in a 6 meter length? When subjective to a torque of 14 km per meter, what maximum shearing stress is developed? Use G equals to 83 GPA. So, to get the maximum shearing stress, you need to find D, D max. So, here's the given angle is 3 degrees, length is 6 meters, and torque is 14, while G is given as 83 GPA. So here's the solution. By using the formula of angle of twist, we get 3 times pi over 180 is equal to 14 times 10 raised to 3 multiplied by 6 over pi times d raised to 4 divided by 32 times 83 times 10 raised to 9. So we get D as 0.11845 meters. So T max. T max is equal to 16 T over 5 times D raised to 3. Since we already got D, which is 0.11845 meters, we can solve for T max. So T max is equal to 16 times 14 times 10 raised to 3 over pi times 0.11845 raised to 3. So we will get Tmax as 42.90 MPA. So for question number 2, determine the length of the shortest 2 mm diameter bronze wire which can be twisted through two completed turns without exceeding a shearing stress of 70 MPA. Use G as 35 GPA. So we have to look for length. Well, the given is D has 2 millimeters, angle is 4 pi, while T max is 70 MPA. So the solution, we use the formula of T max. 70 times 10 raised to 6 is equal to 16 T over pi times 2 M divided by 1000 raised to 3. So we'll get T as 0.11. To get length, we will equate T to this formula. So this formula is angle of twist. Well, angle, angle of twist is given as 4 pi. We can solve for length. So 4 pi is equals to T, which is 0 0.11, multiplied by length over pi, times 2 meters divided by 1,000 raised to 3, divided by 32, times 35, times 10 raised to 9. So we'll get length as 6.28 meters. So that's it for this time.